Chapter 3, Mishnah 6. Having taught that potters are trusted in certain situations and not in others, the Mishnah proceeds to discuss the trustworthiness of tax collectors and thieves, who are likewise trusted only in certain situations. If tax collectors entered the house of a chaver and seized some of his utensils to pay a tax debt, and likewise, if these re thieves return the earthenware utensils they stole to their rightful owners, they are trusted to say, we did not touch any utensils in the house other than the ones we took in the case of the tax collectors, or we did not touch the inside of the earthenware utensils we stole, in the case of the thieves, and the utensils are therefore tahor. The Mishnah now returns to the topic of the previous one. There we learn that Ame Aretz are trusted for Kodesh about the Tara of small earthenware utensils from Modi East and inward toward Jerusalem. The Mishnah now lists another leniency that applies in Jerusalem itself. In this too, there is a distinction between Kodesh and Turumah. And in Jerusalem proper, Amea Arts are trusted about the Tara of even larger earthenware vessels that are used for Kodesh, which were essential for the sacrificial services, but they are not trusted about the utensils used for Tiruma. And during the festival of Pesach, Shavuos, or Sukkot, they are trusted even about utensils used for Tiruma, since everyone has the status of a Haber during a festival.